Well, it is done. I just got to shorten the fuel line up tomorrow. It's leaking a little bit. Other than that, it's led to power steering. Runs good. Got a slightest hesitation on dig, but I think I can get a bigger squirter. Got some bigger squirters I'm going to replace that with. But it pulls. You can romp on it. It don't lose time when you cut it off. But thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Can't polish the turret, but you can paint one. No exhaust leaks. I was worried about exhaust leaks. Let's just sit here and listen to that real quick. Well, nah. We'll do that more. Take it for another long test drive tomorrow, but I want to thank the Lord, man. That little guy carburetor there, that thing gave me a fit. A bunch of different O-rings. Put them in there. No, nope, wrong one. I had to pick another one. So that's, that's the only thing leaking is the fuel line. That's probably a... You can see when you let off the throttle, it's that little... That don't go there, but I, that little orange thing, I put it there. Cause that's a permanent vent. You let off of it. That little door opens. That little deal right there. You get down on it and it closes. So I put that little something to do with a pump. So I put that in there. You can still vent a little bit, but it ain't going to be wide. It's a hole. It's a hole straight into the bowl. So I uh, done that. Had to file on that tang right behind that brass thing. Zinc plated, but thank you, Lord. Now, Baron's probably fall out of it right start knocking. <laughs> ah, but I thank God, man. Oh, I'm telling you, that got me flustered today. The devil was trying to tick me off, and it about worked. But thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. God bless, folks.